Hey everyone, Deadpan here. Welcome back to Hardcore Tarkov, episode 104 here. Hopping on the reserve. Let's get our slamping on. Alright. Here we go. Alright, I mean, this is the marked room. The problem is, I'm not really feeling super confident about defending this with a pistol and a sniper. Try to make it work. Can I vault into this? It's... Could check AU first. There's one up top there. See, I'm really happy I didn't waste a marked room thing, right? Like, I'm super happy I didn't waste a marked room thing. There's one on, as backup and one right out to the side of the right, you know? That's been happening to us a lot today. Like, we've converted a couple of our bad spawns, but, like, I feel like there's the spawns in this game just sometimes are just not conducive to what you need to do, you know? Which is unfortunate. Maybe I should have tried to get distance on them. Because we could have gone for a shooter born heaven kill, but whatever. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? All right. I guess the question now is, do we have enough to redo on that? Who is that armor? Kind of sucked. Could also go to a different map. You know, could also go to a different map. The other thing is, we can also still take that extract out. We just have to have a 3x3 three three slot to work with. I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to do that. I'm not going to, like, sit here and try to make everything work perfectly. You know? Just going to... get You know, give it a, give it a shot, you know? Give it a good old try. Um, hmm, what's that message? Could do a quick factory. Yeah, you can always do a quick factory. I mean, we could also do factories just to get Silent Caliber done as well, you know? Because it's weird. I keep going back and forth on it. There is a we should maybe do the player kills for, for Silent Caliber first, you know? Um, you kind of just convinced me, I think, actually. Because that gives us room, which is nice. Remember, this is a level six versus this. Actually, though, if this... We should do that. We should, we should make this the level, uh... The level six. And this could just be a level five. This has less protection in the right areas. And that'll be like our super armor. So we have, let's see how many, oh my gosh, we have so many suppressors, that's fantastic. Okay, so we actually do have quite a few suppressors, which is good. Let's go to that. Um, let's go to that. And then let's see what kind of piranhas would be great. I don't know how good AP20s will be, but I guess we have them and they're fine. 
There are scenarios on Factory where I'd rather have an AP-20 than Piranhas, but I think getting up close with the Piranhas is quite good. And then, of course, we would like to have Flechettes as well, if we have them. We do. Okay, just the 20, but that's okay. So we can do that, this, this. Don't need this guy. Don't need this guy. I don't hate the idea of having that, but I also like the idea of having just meds. I kind of like the idea of just doing that. And like, well, no, because we want to be able to live pretty quick, you know, pretty easily here. Um, so maybe we're doing that and that, that makes sense to me. And then we're doing that, I guess. I hate this thing, but like, whatever. Don't be meds if you don't get hit. True. True. I can't deny that logic. I don't know where those went, but that's okay. Okay. All right, yeah, no, that's fine. And then we just, we make space. Simple as that. We make space. Hopefully this will save us from pistolings. Um, that's really kind of the only place we want to be at for, with that. And then it's really just a matter of getting shotguns after that, I think. Because it looks like we I was doing a good job of keeping suppressors. Yep, no, let's do that. Quick reset. Alrighty. Let's see what we got. One. Our goal is to kill the other dude with the suppress shotgun. How much this affects your turning radius? I think I heard somebody to the left there. I thought I got him. I don't know why I thought I got him, but GG. Yeah, that's on me. That's on me. Should have kept going around. I, ha I hate Rigor rather rosy, like, fights in general, but nice, nicely done. Nicely done. Well, we got one in a scav. What were they using, I guess, is the question. Oh, I got a headshot of pro. Why wear an Alton? Right? Why on earth would I ever wear an Alton? We're selling the next one. Like, what? Why? What's the point? What's the point? <laughs> uh... <laughs> like, there's like, like, I would have been better off with with better sound and more turning radius that entire fight. They did, but like, like they did nothing. It did absolutely zero. 
I don't know. I don't know. I never liked them before, but I think they're actually worse than they used to be. Oh, well. GG. Nice shots. Oh, that, that's nothing against that guy. That, nice shots. Good job. Well, I was going to pause this, but then it's... Thought we were getting back to the menu, so I don't know. Awkward. Yep. Literally hit pause as it went back to the menu. Okay. So, all good. All good. Um... Hmm. So... So, so, so. Sucks losing that armor. But what are you going to do? Do we have any shotgun barters, I guess? We have that one. So we could theoretically kit out another shotgun. We could... I don't know. There's a lot of options here. Can try to trade for another sniper rifle. Uh, what? Wh who has our sniper rifles? Is it you? Do we have these? We have that, and we have that. So we could do either one of these and go back to reserve. Hmm. I don't know. Kind of at a weird indecision point here. Um, I think... Also, what time of day do we have here? We have enough to get to Insomnia, so I think I might do nighttime sniping for Insomnia kills on reserve. I think that's what we're going to go for. We should be able to suppress this. I actually don't remember what I have versus what I don't have. Okay, we do have it. Good. And then let's just get rid of that. With like a little bit of range here. Is this the one I think it is? This might be the one I... I'm going to go test this one in the um, hideout here. Okay. want to see... So it's a 3x minimum. That's actually fine for the map we're going to be on. It's 3x, 12x. Yeah, that's fine for the map we're going to be on. Let's um put that somewhere else, though, I guess. And do we use this 103 to defend ourselves or not? I don't know on that either. You know what? Uh, we had our key tool and we had important keys, but actually we, we forgot to like swap keys for, for this as well, which is kind of interesting. They all go random places. All right. I'll figure out the keys in a second, uh, during that. No, there's, a, so you have to survive every single map, John, and I need to save every single key I have for that task. We've handed the ones in for the one task, but uh, yeah. In order to get Kappa, we need to survive all the maps in a row. So I got to save all my lapse key cards for that. I have guns in here, too. I always forget about these. Hmm. It's pretty good. I could just bring this 103 in. I could just bring... I don't really have any SMGs to bring in. We, ha we have these 112s. These shoot a little faster. Could just bring an M4 in. We could just bring a pistol in. Um, I don't know. It's so ran. It's so weird. We could bring that Glock 18 in. Yeah, why not? Let's bring the Glock 18 in. Why not? Why not? Where you see people doing that task? Yeah. It's a, it's a Kappa requirement. Oh, I can go in there. Okay. And we are going for Kappa this this playthrough. Um, I kind of want like a 
smaller rig. Because we're not trying to loot too much here. I, I wouldn't say no to some loot, but we're not. I need to have, we can loot like that much. And I think that's fine. I think that's fine. Okay. I'm not going to bring too, too much there. I do have a lot of AP, though, which is nice. Okay. All right, we'll just do that. BS. I think BS is will be what we top up with from there. I might bring like it's unlikely that I shoot 30 rounds of that before getting out. So sometimes it happens. Could bring FMJ, I guess, if we're doing, doing like a crazy long amount of sniping. But we should if I've if I've shot all those, we should have left. I think is my kind of my thought process there. Uh, do I have regular splints? I do. This will let me put the power cord in wherever that ended up. All right. So I got to find the power cord and I got to do um, there it is. I got to Get the power cord there, and then I gotta I gotta fix my keys. So I'm gonna get uh, the key tool sorted out, and then I will see you all. And that'll give us hopefully enough time to get to you know pure nighttime for um, insomnia kills. I gotta make sure I restart this guy as well. Um, and then and our goal is just to not get trapped in the corner like we did. Say, plain and simple, you know, plain and simple. But I will see you all right. All righty. Hopefully we can. Uh... Did I just hear Sturman as I loaded in? How bad is this going to be? Uh, could be worse. It's unfortunately a rather dark night. I guess without the snow, the nighttime sniping is a lot less effective, huh? That's kind of a bummer. Like I can, I can see edges, but yeah, that snow really helped out with that. I do think I genuinely heard Gluhar shout when we got up, though, because the Contact 4s are ridiculous like that. Or can be ridiculous like that. I got the slim med pack from radio. I don't know. I have no idea what that is. Slim med pack. Oh, yeah. You can get that off the Sanitars guards. 
It never it never really spawned in raid prior to that. Or like and any other thing. Like regular skies have never had that. It's only the Sanitar guards. This is terrible. It's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. Should have grabbed like a L can or something. With the contact force, you people hear people shuffling in other maps. I know, I know. It's rather silly. I mean, he's still right there, but that's definitely a scav. Chasing somebody. Okay. They left. All right, well, we got one. It's unfortunate that we didn't get that last one. I guess we could check. But yeah. We did hear a grenade there, so like this this is good minus the fact that I like I can't see when I scope in. <laughs> you know. It's the only downside here. But we'll give it we'll give it a second or two here because it's just yeah. Is that somebody right there? I think it actually was, but I can't I can't scope in like that. Um, get that topped up again. Nice things. We'll be able to go in and loot some of the stuff up here. Darker here too. Part of what should go go and try to get some more pest control kills, but I don't think I want to. I think if this is shot. All right, I'm gonna give it until 32 here, and then we're gonna go loot the dome briefly, fill up as much as we can, and then just leave. See if we see any movement. 
it's also a dark night right now. Like, this is, like, the moon isn't up yet. Maybe, hopefully, the next ray, the moon will be up. But I also might put on a different scope than this one. This one's, this will be good for daytime. Like, clear daytime. And I do like it for sniping. It's, or for long-range sniping, it's quite clear. There. Gosh, that's a night and day difference there. Ay, ay, ay. Maybe I should have left the red dot on top of it. A better, better chance. <laughs> that could have been just a scav. But now that we spotted something, we'll give it a little bit more, a little bit more time here. Shooter board in heaven. And uh, Tarkov Shooter Part 8. A.K.A. Camping. I mean, tactically waiting at uh, Backpackless Extract. Also, Insomnia kills. We have we finally have an Insomnia unlocked. Alright, I think we're going to loot the dome time there's enough stuff in here to make it worth all right this is only a blue laser Got it. Yeah, let's uh Oh, that was looted? Oh, I guess it didn't spawn over here, huh? Could have gone downstairs, downstairs. No, this is can you close this door? No. This is the one with the door. It's already open. Yeah. Most likely went down to D2 and or down to the pawn areas. If it wasn't for the glass in this room, this room would honestly be great for... Uh, Uh, would be great for like hanging out up here and like getting good getting good angles on folks. But there's not too much in this dome, but there's enough. You know, a couple weapons cases. Couple loose weapons parts. We have the key to make the filing cap that's relevant, you know. Definitely need, still need a ton of those. I wish I had the um the one that unlocked the uh, the KPRL. I think it is. People rarely have that one, and you can um. It's just two extra safes right on extract, which is nice. Who knows? Maybe we'll get our vector, uh... Our vector barrel. And other things. We have, we have, you know, we have other things to look out for here. Shame we couldn't get that second guy at uh, the extract. Would have been nice. Is that an MCB? That is an MCB. Nice. Don't know how many of those we'll need. But... 
Ate something. Get this one. There's a lot of toolboxes. My goodness. Most of this we're just going to sell for, like, basically no money whatsoever. But that's all right. Barrels can spawn in the uh, the wooden crates. I don't think they can, but you never know. That actually might be worth going and looking at. Up on the dome, at the least. I think we'll hit these first. So at least we're done looting, so we can just leave if we need to. The moon is coming up, which is good. It's at a weird angle right now, though, so it's like brighter up here than it is down there. seen anything we'll check we'll check when we get up to the dome as well or like the in the cage here that actually might be oh god couldn't tell you holy smokes I mean, they obviously heard me the entire time. Oh. Hey. Congrats on using the correct stuff. Oh, they had a little LPS. Interesting. Oh, they killed somebody then. It's possible. Oh, I can't take the I can't take that plus there plus our armor. That's fine. Alright, we need to make some cuts because there's some of this stuff that I do want here. Like all of this can go. I know when you're both trying to do shooter board in heaven. I wonder if we we're both shooting at the uh <laughs> the people extracting. That is entirely possible. I don't think the cords are worthwhile. So I can bring one of these, so I'll bring, I guess I'll bring those. Yeah, yeah, we, we've, we finally got Red Rebel. End of last episode, like I said, was super good for us. We got Red Rebel, we got... Um, Bullshit done. We got, you know, we got a lot of stuff done. All right. Not feeling that. I will be looting these, though. This is this is very clearly who looted over here as well. Uh, no body armor and a paracord. So while we're in the extract, we have to take our armor off. So you can wear armored 
uh, vests, like armored rigs. That works still. Yeah, it is. It is fair game. So uh, that's usually what people do, but I just I I'm playing hardcore, so I don't have options. You know. <laughs> well, our first raid we went into, we had that, but then we died, right? So all right, GG. I'll take that. Two insomnia kills is great, honestly. Yeah, two two insomnia kills is phenomenal there. And we have a backup sniper rifle. I'll take that. All right, good stuff. Fine little backup. Uh, I guess we'll swap. Um, that does something. I don't remember what. These are all good. Yeah, these are all good. Was that my LPS? Maybe that was my LPS. That may have been my LPS. Just going to eat that now. Unload. Load. Like the Glock that they were using. This can get sold. I think that these can get sold. This is going here. This can go there. We can sell this. We can sell this. I may swap out. What we're using. I don't think we need this. Or the scope we're using, rather. that many i will i will take a little extra though it's backups okay all right let's get that little pile sold here and then we're i suppose good to go yeah 60k for that it's probably actually worth more on the flea market to be honest Is a, it is a high-level quest key. Okay. We'll leave that there for now. And I think we're good. Oh, I wanted to see maybe if we should or could swap out that scope. It's really bad. It will be brighter. I'm not really sure what'll be better though. Like these are terrible with NVGs. I know that for a fact. I we could trade for a Valde. Maybe that'll be a slightly better, but usually those are pretty bad too. Let's trade for it and see. It's two vodkas from somebody. Is it you? Who's got it? You? Nah, that's you. We have a ton of vodkas here, so. Let's um let's go take a look at it in the hideout and see where we're at. Oh, and our Skype case is back. Nice. I think I have that already. Uh, could run this, but I think I'm gonna run this guy and run that one overnight. Just makes more sense time wise, I think. I don't think we have anything. I can't use that one. That's for the gunsmith. So yeah. Like, it looks good in this, but it's just, like, the, the dark darkness is, is rough, comparatively. But I think, I think we're going to give that one a shot instead of this guy. We don't need to be so far zoomed in. It's nice, but it's... Yeah, maybe that'll be a, ever so slightly cleaner. Uh, I think we're going to make this, make the water, and then we'll turn the water into Akamaris for the barter later on. Okay, good. Yeah. That's installing, of course. 
Yeah, once we're done with that. Anything else here we want to craft? We could upgrade this guy, I guess, but I think I'd rather craft armor. Oh, interesting. Could have done that for the, with the Paco. That's kind of cool. I don't hate that. Definitely don't want to craft that by itself. We did, We got access to this craft as well. Yeah. It's just the problem getting the plates. Oh, this, that one needs a sledgehammer for a craft. That's kind of funny. I think, we, I think we talked about that a long time ago. All right. Yep. Uh, rinse and repeat. Keep working on insomnia kills. Keep working on Shooterborn Heaven, Tarkov Shooter Part 8. And uh, hopefully we don't get spawned in the corner. Ooh, nice. We got a dome spawn. So now this spawn... Um, is great. There can be somebody relatively close by. We're going to try to get over to here first. It is much brighter already tonight, which is good. Because we might be able to gate somebody coming in. And we should be able to hear the folks to our, le or our right come in here. They're in shadow and we are not. And I don't like that. Hit him. Boy, do I not see them, though. Just panicked there a little bit, because I didn't get in position in time. I'm fairly sure Tarkov Shooter Part 8 needs to be headshots. I don't think it anything else counts. Snow was so much better for this. I mean, they're hurting regardless of where we hit them. Looks like they only had a pistol. But. They, they pretty much know they got shot from the dome there. We heard a few shots over by the Raiders. Keep ourselves on one X here. Yeah, there's an argument that maybe I should have panic shot there, but the best place to have gotten when they were running, sh you know, in that line from the truck. But we just weren't in position yet. Fairly certain that's a scav walking over. Yeah. Let that be. Mostly to save bullets, to be honest.
grenade over on the other side. Or where that last LAV is that we need for Peacekeeper. I'm not going to risk it right now because we're, you know, trying to get three kills and survive. I do wonder if we brought in that VPO for some close quarter sniping. Yeah, probably not. I think that VPO will be good for streets. I think this is a slower but a little bit better for us strategy. Or better for me strategy. Where I got a little bit more patience. Oh, hello. Rip that, rip that kill. Botch that a little bit. But they also, I, I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to shoot under the uh, truck there. So. And there was a time crunch there, right? It's like a seven second thing. But I, I had I had a few more seconds there to maybe line up a better shot for the neck. But it's all good. It's all good. Again, surviving is really important here as well. I don't think that was this person that we saw earlier. It is starting to get ever so slightly brighter out here, but this is like, I know I keep saying it, but it keeps going through my brain. The snow for sniping is awesome because nighttime sniping is really great. And the snow just made that like, like I could see everything happening over there, you know? Oh, oh no. Damn. Don't think you can shoot through those tires. Bomber. All right, that's that's two out. So I think we're just not getting there. Yeah, that's a real bummer. I it, we were looking at the wrong we were looking at the wrong spot for that for that person. Because there's a good chance we could have got them while they're crawling in. This is why you prone and crawl under the under the truck. By the way, it's really hard to get sh headshot there. So. Oh yeah, I wanted to look with that MVGs and see if they were. It was clear. Almost 100. Mori with a 98 month resubmarino. Thank you so much. Nah, it's not quite clear yet. Our dome area is a little bit, but yeah, it's like roughly the same. But I have more peripheral this way. Mori, big cheers. 98 months in the mood is a hell of a long time. Thank you, thank you. Let's try to get keys. I might go check the other, um, the other hill. See what we get there. No, I guess we do need any and all amount of money. Unlikely we won't fill up here, but. good because we're going to be trying to save for stash four you know what? i think i just did one side. no i did this yeah. frame was like you didn't do both sides of that uh, we did
That's KPRL. I love KPRL. No idea where that person was. They had to have been close. Uh, maybe not, though. Maybe they just watched us the whole time. I, I genuinely don't know. Good shot either way. Real bummer. But because we didn't hear any steps or anything like that. But also contact fours if you're if you're bopping around like yeah they were doing the same thing we were. If you're like running around like you can't hear anything else. That was unexpected. That wasn't that unexpected. That's the risk you take on going up on those, you know, cliffs and hills. So, I, I suspect that they were on a rooftop now, though, actually, now that they're sniping like that. But maybe they were just right down below, and they just, they heard us walking, and were just like, I'm not going to move, you know. Dems is the beats. Nice shot. Alrighty. Well, now we're down to, like, it's so crazy how fast you, like, lose armor in this game. Like we just basically have none now, which is pretty wild. All right, what do I want to do is the question. What do I want to do? Could go hunt Killa. I think that's a really early in the morning thing. Could go hunt Sturman. We could go back to reserve without Shooterborn and have it in mind and like look for all of our stuff. We could... Go to streets. I don't think I want to go to streets, though. Well, it's not that I have too much. I have a lot of crap. I just don't have a lot. Of, like, we don't have a lot of armors. Like, we've been using our good armors. Could go to Shoreline. Try to get those things done again. Because we're, like, we're so close to just being completely done with Shoreline. I think. Which is nice. Could keep working on Silent Caliber. drug trafficking like that's a this is a big one that i would love to get done yeah so i think it's i think it's reserve or reserve interchange or woods i think like a little Sturman hunting. Try to get the next one unlocked so that you know we can do it the other way. Could also use our new 11 SR key and look for and every map we go to we want to look for weapons parts. I think that's really what we got going on here. Uh, I guess we don't have NVGs at the moment. So what does that leave us with? Kind of reserve esque. Could go daytime reserve with this thing. Feeling sniping right now. Could go. It's just there's so many options, you know. Hmm. Could. genuinely don't know what to do here there's, there's just too many options and like no obvious ones what would we do if we we're trying to get killer as well is there anything else to do on interchange or is that basically it that's it i don't think that that might finish up interchange for us I mean, we have a good rig for this. We have okay guns for this.
So I guess that's what we're doing. Anonymous with 25 gifted subs. Holy smokes, Anonymous. That is a heckin' lot of gifted subs. Thank you very much. Can we get some epic love and hype in this chat, please? Gifted subs are a humongous deal. And really support the content. Thank you, thank you. Holy guacamole. Thank you, thank you. You know you are. Big cheers. Much appreciated. And, uh, yeah. Thank you all the new followers today as well. Appreciate that. I think I'd like to get rid of that. I don't think I want to use a Valde for this, but... I don't know what we got. I think I would like to... I'd rather use this. Okay, and then what do we have here? Do we actually have BP to get Killer with? A little bit here. Okay. Okay, so we could do that and that. I would like more than a grenade. Like, I guess we have to go get some grenades going here. I don't want level four trade. I just want trades. Can I get eight? I can get four. I don't understand. This thing gets so funky. Because it auto-selects it, but then if you screw that up, it just doesn't let you do anything else. So silly. So very silly. All right, we'll bring two of those. We're going to go... Our attempt is going to be backpackless. I am going to equip this so we can trade for some armor, though, because that's what we really need to do. And I wouldn't say no to, like, armor that's good enough, but also armor that we don't mind getting rid of. Um... to in order to uh take killa's armor and then we're gonna do that 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 where's my i guess i lost on that raid that's a bummer uh we're gonna do this Sorry, I'm not moving very fast. The menus today. I don't know why. I mean, I know why, but I'm, you know. And then that. And then I do want something to fix. I guess, I guess we ran out of those. I don't know. It's weird. I, I, I thought we had extras of those, but I guess not. Um... All right, we'll do it that way. Okay, and then this is to put on the helmet. All right. And then I got to heal all with the uh, with the button there. Okay, uh, that will be our attempt. And this is for the helmet. Um, I guess I could also wear the helmet. Uh and, of course, there's always a chance that Killa is not up. Oh, and then we got to do the key thing, right? Uh, which also involves... Maybe I'll put those there. I got to get... A docks case free here. Or free enough to put stuff in. Okay, we won't be sad if we lose that one. That one. Uh, this one, and then this will let us put in 11 SR. I don't think I have anything. I have the power key, like whatever, but I guess we might as well. No reason to not. Also, let's just put the money in. 
and have room for keys. So do not bring that in, Dead Pine. Okay, yeah. All right, cool, cool. Um, I want to avoid the chumming times. Although, is this is this in insomnia time? Maybe I do. Maybe I don't want to avoid chumming times and just get insomnia done. Uh, well, we need a flashlight for that. For some reason, I thought. 22 and 5. Nah, nah, it's too close. We'll just go daytime. I'll see you on raid. Alrighty. Let's see what we can do here. This is quite a good spawn. I, don't, I can't remember if it's 48 or 38 for killer. I think it's 38. I don't really know what our goal is if kill is not up. I guess that's the reason to go nighttime, is like you can at least. If kill is not available, you can at least get some kills. I had to been shooting at somebody. I, that might be a player. That might not have been a player. I guess we could go for weapons parts. That's like our nice best thing. Oh, I guess we could turn on power, or if somebody turns on power, we could take this out. Wish I had a flashlight, though. This could also just have been a scav here, by the way. That's a player. They're slow crouch walking in. One GBR gifted a tier one sub to Mel Taylor. They have given 33 gift subs in the channel. Them. I don't know. Hard to say. Were you a player? You were not a player. We need if power's on, we'd still have to go upstairs to to do it.
But yeah, all good and all good. You know, run around as much lately, new job, new city, um, and stuff. All good. Yeah. You get settled in. We'll be here. You know. That's and if you don't have time as much from the new job, all good as well. You know. I actually don't know how big the vector barrel is. I'll, like build their own uh build their own AK here. Another one of my problems, like, realistically, we wanted to hunt killer, we should just leave. But I hate being in a raid and just not doing lots of stuff, you know? This is why I'm never gonna get the 50 killer kills. I can, ne I can never do it. The only way I could do it is if we had ever had a non wipeable character. It's one by two. Through this, this sells well enough. I mean, there's also a five seven without any sights, which is just so silly. But we gotta do. Fairly certain those can spawn empty, but I'm not 100% on that. I think they said something about fixing that at one point. I don't know why I waited that long. I'm stuck on something, which is going to cause my demise. I shouldn't be that confused, honestly. I know I'm not shooting well today, you know. It's dark. Where? There? Okay. Got it. This this thing does cover a lot of the frame, huh? Hmm. Like, it's very difficult to see around that. Yeah. Captain, good to have you in the mood. Always. Ooh. I technically need that, but I think I'd rather barter. Like, this is, like, my least favorite shotgun. Has the shortest barrel, only four rounds, and a pistol grip. Like, eh, I think it'll be all right. Without that.
bummer on that. I really wish I had a flashlight. We're just like kind of in a never ending loop here. I don't need to be doing this. Why are you not dead? He was shooting at somebody else. It felt like he was shooting at somebody else. That said, sometimes they shoot with their gun sideways. He located? Nah, it's just a helmet. 6P47. All right. I've wasted enough bullets and time here. I will choose to be slightly cautious of maybe that guy was not shooting at us. This way to backpack list and not worry about it. Some shotguns out there, I guess. Might be worth going for. That one's good. That one's, that one's fine, too. Hey, JB, how are you? It is good to see you. Let's so sell that. Feels like there's some spawns here that are supposed to be up, but that aren't. I guess it doesn't really matter so long as we get the vector to, you know, barrel. Oh, yes, please. I helped so much. That stuff's pretty good. A little bit too much pen. But it is good. Been working a lot. Been in Seattle the last month. Ah, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Do you travel a lot for your job, or is that just... Like, are you traveled there for your job? Obvi like, obviously for your job, or is that you? You just work there and you live in Seattle, or like you're setting up again in Seattle.
stack up these. Careful, you save your job. Gotcha, gotcha. Definitely has a lot of its own stresses, of course. Traveling a lot for your job. But also, you know, has a lot of... Get to see the country on the job's dime, which is pretty cool, you know? So, definitely some positives and negatives there. I feel like we've had this conversation before. <laughs> if not with you, I definitely feel like I've had this conversation with, other, with someone else. Because there was an opportunity, and I'm glad I didn't take it, but there was an opportunity that I could have done a convention job. No, less recently, like five years ago. Um, but yes, if, yes, also with Mark, but that's not what I'm thinking of. Um... I guess I could wear that. Is it conflicting with the beret? Um, I was going to say. And it would have been a neat job. I think it would have had a lot of cool opportunities in it. Um, and I think I was well suited for the job, but I would have been, I would have been gone, you know, 26 out of the 52 weekends of the year. And I didn't really want to do that. So. On top of streaming, you know. So, GG, by the way. Uh, it's, you know, that was a whatever raid. When we were hunting Killa. I do think that might be the strategy going forward, though, is um, trying out nighttime for chumming. And then, well, when people are there active for chumming kills. So, at least I can maybe try to get some kills um, if Killa's not up. Uh, feels like Killa has not been up a lot of these raids, you know. But... I haven't really done too, too many interchange raids, I guess. All right, let's look at us closer to a few things. This is good for sniping. This is... Kit your own AK. Territory. I think I'm just... I want to... We have the one we need for... Um, Kappa, so I think I'm just going to sell that one. I guess we could barter, then sell. I don't know. It's such a... Annoying item. This is free armor, which is good. In fact, that's actually, like, the kind of armor I want for this. But I also don't want to store this armor, so... Oh, well. Uh, now, why don't we do that and then that? I think what I'm going to do is this. And then we'll just top load with the T45M so we don't waste as much. And I think I'm going to give it maybe one more go. And then I got to clean up stuff. But that's a... I can do that in between. You know. Future future dead pine problems here. Oh, I guess I need to find room for this AK. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Room found. Alright, let's give it a shot. I guess this is the chumming times. Oh, and I also would like to do... that 
and get that going. I, I kind of want to get rid of this site too. The site was really blocking my screen. So let's do that instead. Yeah. Okay. Yep. I'll see you, mate. All right. So we start heading center just in case he is up. I know it's more likely that he's not up as opposed to up, but... Started 40% work done as either. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that makes sense. Because it depends on the job you're doing. Some, you know, some jobs... A million's like an absurd amount, and then some jobs a million's like just a drop in the bucket, right? Depending on what you're doing. I'm talking ge generic jobs, not necessarily. Your specific job, you know. But I guess I'll grab it just in case. I don't think that was at me. I think it's hitting around me, though. Yeah, that one seems to be empty a lot. up an idea. Oh, is this the one I need, chat? That might be the one I need. I think that's the one I need. Okay. I need to focus up a little bit and get out of here. And by that I mean just chill. Take a second, listen. Dinner, Oscar. Gotta love time zones, Mark. Gotta love time zones. Don't think beelining here is smart. Yeah. It's a DBL, maybe? going to be the barrel we needed and i should have taken the other direction also how are they over to the right more maybe there's a buddy there had to have been a buddy right 
because we shot at them to the way left there. And they weren't sprinting. They were walking. Huh. I thought that was weird. I, think it just, I just didn't expect them to be that far to the right. Very odd. Very odd. All right, YouTube, I hate that this episode, I'm a bit of a bummer there, but I, you know, kind of just struggling to get through these. So, all good. Hopefully, that's not the barrel we needed. I think it was, though. So, I think we're going to be really regretting that later on <laughs> when we're doing our gunsmiths. But we still need the vector barrel. We still need all these other things. And it's not like people don't use the mutants with the longer barrels. So, we'll see. But, <coughs> excuse me. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching these all the way through. Really appreciate those who do. And uh, I will catch you next one.